If we now switch in our capturing folder, you see we have take two. Um, yeah, some frames, not important. But as you see in the motion file, I can open it. You see we don't have really a moving in our uh, motion, but we see we have a fixed position and we can now use that position for our element. So we don't have to position it in after effects. And I want also capturing for an entire effect one of that um, in eye views from one player. And I think I will use um, SX. So go back and turn off the campus by using flag zero and also turning that off I use an underline score to disable the comments and click on go to and of course um, turn on the recording also here and click on here go to and press play so and uh, that was our last capturing and now I can close or minimize half level advanced effects and now into after effects and um, let's check our capturing we have these three takes and now starting with importing every yeah capturing first of all I have to delete the uh, hood alpha and hood color because I don't really need them and that's it now switch to the folder click on the first image click on open and now we have our imported video as you see that's what we captured so import also the dev and I group them now in a folder called capture one or, th or something like that and now the next capturing take one and also the dev and group in two import right click file and now the last take import file and also the dev and group in three so now create the compositions so just drag and drop on this icon and do the same with the rest so that our comes um, of course I don't I, uh, I don't change the FPS currently uh, you can also change that to our main frames per second and also here ninety frames per second of course so deleting the comp and create new comps so that's it now click on the first comp as you see that was in my case the campus animation and we want a uh, text or some 3d elements in on this wall for example therefore we click on file script run script and as you see in our Adobe script folder in my case in documents Adobe scripts we can use the half-life advanced effects cam center 40 
uh, one four and that is the newest version of course and you can download it of course I showed from advancedfx.org after effects import script so now click on import Harley cam file switch to our folder in the first take and that's the right window and select the motion file click on open so after importing that we see maybe here we have a lot of keyframes and I change to layer mode you see named Harla e cam X and Z and Y and first of all click double on that cam file and you see we have to change the angle of view it's in our case field of view we used in Counter-Strike and default is 90 degree in Counter-Strike we could of course change that in the fourth field field of view of course and for example we have used 40 we have to change that to 40 here but we have default 90 the next step mainly we want add and 3d text therefore we would just enter some stupid text like advancedfx.org and make them 3d and would now change into the different views we see cam is okay left the cam is here so change the position of our text nearly to the cam and I think it's something like that looking good and also go to top and it's looking good so if we now switch to our Harley cam the text is in front of us and now if we move we see the text is yes fixed to a point nearly the city spawn point now we would move that text forward and would rotate them I use shift and so and now if we try to positionate the text on the right position it uh, yeah it's, it's it's really hard for a lot of people right here uh, because it isn't right um, perfect so we captured also come to which was that very short animation but we have the um, position so therefore click on file scripts run script using the newest version and import the second take and the motion file and as you see that's our motion so if we click on position we see the position don't changed and we now write the current op position so therefore just click on yes copy so we now copied this position value if we would go into an uh, notepad you would see it's looking something like that we copied the position so now we go back to our comp to the text just click on our position you can open it with P click on position and click on paste 